Hey guys and uh, welcome to our channel. As you can see today we are performing one little experiment. Let me tell you what is it all about. Uh, here we have two uh, airsoft guns, one pistol uh, CZ Shadow 2 and one revolver from Umarex uh, replica of Ruger revolver. So uh, the topic today is will generic cheap sunglasses protect you, protect your eyes uh, while playing airsoft games and we will experiment with it today so stay with us until the end if you want to know the results. So let me tell you something about uh, these two airsoft guns and their power. First this is CZ Shadow 2, you have a tabletop review on our channel already, if you didn't watch it, you can watch it on this card here, by clicking this card here. This is one joule of power, about 100 meters per second, uh, which is about uh, 320 uh, feet per second. So, it's about uh, average power for such an airsoft gun for airsoft games. Uh, one joule is about average power. On the other hand, here we have something a bit different. It's Ruger revolver from Umarex, which has a lot more power, three times more power, so it's three joules of power and its speed is around 150 meters per second or uh, about almost, almost 500 feet per second. So it's more powerful uh, a lot more powerful than, uh, than uh, this CZ Shadow 2. So let's go on with our experiment then. So let's continue with the experiment. This is uh, the first try. We are shooting these sunglasses with a one joule airsoft pistol loaded with 6mm plastic BBs, uh, 0 0.2 grams. And uh, the magazine is uh, loaded with uh, green gas, so we will see the impact it uh, makes on the sunglasses. I have set up the, some kind of protection behind, so the glasses uh, don't go far away. And I will shoot from a very close range, about half a meter, to maximize the impact. It's very unlikely that you will get shot. You will get a shot uh, directly into your uh, safety goggles or glasses that you are wearing uh, from that close of a distance. But uh, this is just for the purposes of all purposes of the experiment to maximize, maximize the impact. So let's try shooting the sunglasses from close range. Of course, I should tell you that I'm wearing these safety goggles to protect myself from bouncing of the BB into my eye. And I advise you always to wear such protective goggles. But now we will see are these sunglasses, sunglasses enough to protect you from direct heating of one joule powered airsoft gun. Let's see. Okay, let's see the input. As you can see, the sunglasses broke. As you saw, the sunglasses broke very easily and the hole is pretty big. Not only that they broke, but even the particles from crashing the sunglasses are around the table, so I had to move them away. So even one jewel is enough to break the cheap sunglasses, so don't even think about using them as your safety goggles 
while playing airsoft games. Of course, that was for, from very close range. Let's see what will happen if we go a bit further away. Now I'm gonna hit, uh, shoot the sunglasses from a, about a meter or meter and a half. So it's about 3.3 to 4.5 feet, I think. Let's see what will happen. Let's check the sunglasses. As you can see, again, they broke. Not only that they broke, the BB hit the background and then bounced away around the room and uh, went uh, very close to me and finished its uh, journey, its way uh, over the other end of the room. So, do I really need to test at all the more powerful gun? Let's do it just for the experiment to see what will happen with the other green sunglasses. So for next experiment when I will be shooting with a Ruger Revolver that has 3 joules of power here it is I set up different safety behind the green sunglasses uh, it's a pack of printing paper which would uh, surely be better in stopping the BB from bouncing too much after hitting the sunglasses and I will be shooting a bit further more uh, from about one and a half or almost two meters because it's more powerful airsoft gun three times more powerful so let's see what happens First shot and the second shot. So, as you can see, it was very easy for such a powerful gun to destroy these cheap sunglasses so never consider wearing such cheap sunglasses as protection from direct heat of course if uh, I was uh, 5 meters on 10 meters away maybe the results will be different but <laughs> I wouldn't really want to know and I wouldn't risk anything so you can see not only that they broke there are a lot of debris on the table so this airsoft gun three joules of power really destroyed these cheap sunglasses so what we have concluded from today's experiment never i repeat never ever experiment and be cheap with your safety. It's the most important thing when you're dealing with any kind of guns, handguns, even firearms, air guns, airsoft or whatever. Please use something like this. It doesn't cost that much and it's much cheaper than losing your eye. God forbid. So as you saw even one joule of power can hit you in the eye through the sunglasses easily of course when shot from close range uh, you could be hit in the eye only by accident when playing airsoft games because uh, 
the rules are different, you are hardly ever aiming into the eye and uh, of course you will almost never be shot from such a close range, maybe the closest one will be 5 meters or 10 meters away, so the power, the power will be much less than uh, the one uh, we used here to break these sunglasses, but why risk anything? If you would like uh, to support us, please subscribe to our channel, hit like, share and comment, ask some other questions. All the air guns, airsoft guns and uh, air pistols or revolvers you see on our channel will be tested and reviewed separately in our other future videos, so be sure to subscribe not to miss any of uh, them coming next. Thank you for your time, play safe, stay safe and bye bye.